Many educators are still waiting for guidance from the state on how they're supposed to implement the new law on age appropriate books. Today, the board did not provide any more answers. Confusion in the classroom. The president of the Board of Education admitted Thursday that educators are frustrated with the lack of guidance on how to implement the law that removes certain books from school classrooms and libraries. But during the meeting, the board made it clear that schools will have to wait even longer for answers. We get feedback from the field, which is helpful in terms of what perhaps we thought was clear and isn't clear. Um, and as we get that feedback, we review it on a case-by-case -case basis and determine how to uh, appropriately respond. The president of the board urged them to come up with guidelines soon. A woman who spoke during public comment asked them to do the same. They're still waiting on your action as far as implementing administrative rules and the DE's assistance in better understanding the law. So they're kind of feeling in limbo. KCCI reached out to over 300 Iowa school districts to see how they are implementing this law. Many say they're still waiting for guidance from the state. Cal Community School District says the sooner they receive guidance and the clearer it is, the faster everyone can act on the expectations. Waukee Community School District says since they have not received guidance about what they call, quote, the vague areas of the new legislation, end quote, they are taking a broad interpretation of the law to protect their teachers from disciplinary action. Other school districts allege the state hasn't helped them at all. The law went into effect on July 1st, but educators who keep the books in their classrooms or school libraries will not be penalized until January 1st. Now, during this morning's meeting, the board also voted to adopt three changes to emergency rules for Iowa's new education savings accounts. For more on those changes, visit KCCI.com. Stacy.